to evaluate the improper integral of 1 over x from 1 to infinity, we'll replace that upper bound of infinity with a variable, say, b, and then consider the limit as b goes to infinity. So by definition of an improper integral, this is equal to this. Now we have a perfectly normal integral, and we can evaluate it and then take the limit. The integral of 1 over x, of course, is ln x. So here's that integral. We have the natural log of the upper bound minus the natural log of the lower bound. Notice we're not using absolute value bars here because the inputs of the log function, in this case, are positive. B is positive because it's going to positive infinity, and 1 is positive as well. Then, what does this limit equal? Well, the natural log of 1 is just 0, and the natural log of B, as B goes to infinity, hopefully you know that diverges to infinity. The natural log function gets arbitrarily large, and so this limit diverges to positive infinity. Hence, this improper integral does not exist we say that it is divergent. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions, and be sure to check out my Calculus 2 course and Calculus 2 exercises playlists in the description for more. Thanks for watching.